Firstly, I had my history as my optional, so it's probably not a question that I should answer because I had that base uh, knowledge. But at the same time, um, I would advise people to prioritize. So if, for example, if it's their first attempt and they feel if they're spending too much time on world history and like neglecting uh, GS2 and GS3, I think that's not something that I would suggest to them. I would say that, you know, uh, make sure that you do your GS4 first in terms of, you know, that's a major chunk and requires relatively little effort than the other uh, papers as well. And like towards the end, if they feel that, you know, they can devote more time to it, they should uh, give more time to uh, post-independence in world history. So I think a prioritization is required. If you're giving your second or third attempt and you, if you're just leaving it because, you know, oh, no questions come, then, then, it, then it's just bad on your part if you do have the time and you're not doing it. Sir, I feel there are certain parts in the paper which um, in all four, so say something like internal security or society or disaster management. I think um, if you just look at previous year question papers, something which I did, previous year question papers and sort of a one um, basic material that you prepare, it can give a lot of rewards because there are there's a certain similarity of questions sometimes which is asked and the uh, words are very clearly mentioned in the syllabus. So something in society, say population, urbanization, women's uh, issues. So I think I used to just prepare one or two pages notes of all of these things, keep on adding. So prepare sometimes certain templates as well. So uh, secularism, communalism are clear cut words. So um, in terms of an introduction and a conclusion, certain lines that you can prepare. I remember Sarvadhar Sambhav or 12th Rocky Edict of Ashoka. These are things that you could use. Similarly, there was this Swacheta Shivasta judgment on population, which I thought of that I could use and it came also in the paper. So these were things that, you know, if you put a little effort in, in just making one or two pages notes. So for society, for each of the things in the, um, in the syllabus, I had made one or two pages notes and I kept adding nice lines, examples from the newspaper or any other sources I could find.